Welcome to an overview of the deep vein thrombosis data acquisition and management process for the EU co-funded Thrombus Plus project. This research is grounded in high quality clinical data collected from five European hospitals, ensuring diversity through contributions from multiple physicians and the use of various ultrasound devices and probes. Our standardized protocol guides physicians through a comprehensive examination. The scanning process focuses on four specific anatomical locations along the leg. We begin high on the thigh in the subinguinal area, capturing transverse views of the major vessels. The physician then systematically moves down the leg, performing the critical vein compression test at each scanning location. This maneuver assesses the vein's response to external pressure from the ultrasound probe, a standard practice for evaluating vein wall integrity and patency. This meticulous scanning ensures all necessary diagnostic features are captured. Once the images are acquired, the data management process begins with patient privacy as the highest priority. The physician utilizes a dedicated application developed internally to locally anonymize all patient information. The anonymized data are then securely transferred to the electronic case report form repository. This central platform is where all the clinical and imaging data are uploaded, thoroughly described and digitally signed by the responsible physicians. The final critical step involves the data annotation platform, where the collected ultrasound images are prepared for training our artificial intelligence models. Experts meticulously label the data across four scanning levels, identifying the key anatomical structures, noting any anomalies, and grading image quality using the ASEP grading scale to ensure consistency and comparability across all hospital datasets. They subsequently trace the contours of vessels and surrounding tissues with precision, paying particular attention to the presence and characteristics of thrombi, the abnormal blood clots that underlie deep vein thrombosis. This work is part of the Horizon Europe Innovation Action Thrombus Plus, wearable continuous point of care monitoring, risk estimation and prevention for deep vein thrombosis, co-funded by the European Union. For more information, visit thrombus.eu.